if you're in the process of changing domain names from an old domain name to a new one and you would like to retain uh, your Google Analytics account as well as the previous data as opposed to creating a new Google Analytics account and having your data split you know between the old domain name and the new one then this video will explain how to do this so uh, when you log into your analytics in this case uh, this is the the old domain name prestige-decorating.com and we're, we're switching to a new domain name prestigedecor.ca so the way we would do this is we would log into the Google Analytics account of the old domain name and we would come into uh, the tracking info section here and, and you can get here by going to admin you would come to the tracking info oops tracking code and then you would copy this tracking code to the new website okay it would have to be on every single page and you can uh, you can use Google Tag Manager to do this or you can implement the code directly in the website uh, HTML and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to this website the old one and remove the code from there so so this code should only be on one URL then once you do that you're gonna come here and then you would change this to the new domain name and just make sure you click save and then you're going to do that uh, for this as well. Just go to property settings and then you can change it right here and change your uh, default URL for your property. And you can do that uh, in here as well. And you're going to come here and change all these to the new domain. And uh, you can see in this scenario here we have this is indexed so you want to remove that. Okay, and it says it's optional. You can read about it but just remove that when you're implementing it in the new one. And then finally what you want to do is you want to go to user management and here you're going to add the new account, the new email account and you want to give it all these permissions and then um, and then once if in the future you decide to get rid of this old domain name and the old email you're going to have this account transferred to the new, uh, new account that you added. So there you have it, that's the process uh, and the reason why I created this video is because I actually spoke to Google AdWords and asked them if I'm able to retain the same old account and continue the data in this account as opposed to creating a new account for a new, new domain name and they told me that I actually can't do this and that I would have to create a new property for the new domain name but then um, I, I spoke to the Google Tag implementation team and they were really helpful and told me as a matter of fact that I could do this and this is the process so I felt like I would share it with the world. So there you have it. If you found this video useful, please like it and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Cheers.